So this will be part 7 and in this part we are going to create a REST API to do get, post, put and delete. In the previous class we created an API to do a get request and we are able to uh, do a get request to display a static data right here. So now we are going to do um, get, post, put and delete and that is quite easy to do. Um, I also have this uh, step by step right here. So to make it easy I'm going to continue with the same file I already have. Um, so what I'm going to do now, meanwhile if you are joining me for the first time, remember to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any updates from me. Um, so now we have the first one, we have um, this gate, this is home as you can see. The procedure is right on this page so you can actually follow it. And it's quite intuitive, so they have this adult gate, so it's going to be handle a get request. Uh, actually, I'm going to just copy all this and paste. So this is adult post, adult delete, and adult um, so adult post and adult delete. So I'm going to copy this and paste. So basically, uh, we are sending different um, response based on what you have. So if I go to add the post to slash, I should have uh, this message of um, um, post, mess post request for the home page. Um, then we also can have app.update and then in that case you need to write an update query. I think, let me see if I have it. Um, so let me see, I guess you have app.update. Okay, this does not exist. Um, so I think we can all, we can do it when we are going to be actually uh, using the data from the database we are going to be doing this. Okay, so what I'd like us to do now, let's run this application and let's use Postman because we can't do uh, get and delete in the browser. We have to use Postman and I'm going to terminate this and I'm going to start this. So I'm going to run the application again. So I'm going to say node api.js and if I go to portrait 300 slash home, this is fine, and go to slash uh, slash home, let's see, get slash home, okay, so we have get slash home, so post is to slash, so we can do post here, so I'm going to use postman, if I have postman, postman, okay. So if you don't have Postman, please just download and install Postman on your system. Uh, so I have, let me just show you. In case you want Postman, just go to Google and type Postman download. And you can download it for free. So when you open Postman, this is how it opens up. So I'm going to dismiss this. And simply place your um, URL uh, here and then hit the enter key. So our URL in this case is, I'm going to say it's going to be slash home. Okay, so I'm going to copy this URL, so I'm going to copy it, and I'm going to use postman, and place it right here, and send. And you can see it works well. So if I use post now, and post is going to slash, and removing this, I'm sending, and you can see it says welcome to post. So actually post request is also working as well. So this is get post put and delete, but we are not going to stop here. The next thing we are now going to do, we are going to now fetch data from actually from the database and use it to serve this request. So let's go back to the, yeah. So this is what we are saying. We want to now see where we can fetch data from the um, uh, from our database and use it to solve this request. So that's what we are going to be doing in the next class. I remain kind and ingenious. Please remember to subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment if you have any challenges. So we'll see you in the next part.